Kim Kardashian set to star in and produce comedy The Fifth Wheel. Kim Kardashian will be crossing over to the film space now that she's been tapped to star and produce a new film titled The Fifth Wheel. According to Deadline, the film is a female-driven comedy written by Paula Pell and Janie Brito. Kim K will produce alongside Pell, with five studios said to be fighting for the rights to the film, with Kim reportedly pitching it across town. The keen interest is there, despite her limited experience as an actress. While she's getting ready to hit the big screen, Kim is also keeping up with her duties as a mom. In a new interview with GQ, Kim revealed she has to do damage control when she found out her daughter, North, was scamming people at her lemonade stand. Tommy and Avirex launch collab collection featuring Leather Bumber. A long teased Tommy Jeans and Avirex collaboration has now been formally released. Thursday, the collaboration, which serves as part of this year's ongoing celebration of hip-hop's 50th year, was launched to the public. Comprised of three pieces, the collection's much-discussed highlight in a white leather bumper that calls to mind the sustaining influence of the 1990s fashion. Also featured among the trio of new pieces are a black hoodie and a t-shirt, both which bring together Tommy and Avi Rex iconography. Feels holds fans to an exclusive Feels Good EP listening party. What up guys, it's your boy Big B Mid is super hype man. And tonight I just attended Feels Listening Party. And um, what I can say tonight is I'm more surprised because I know Feels to be somebody that will always go out of the box. Ace Nigerian record producer, singer and songwriter, Philip Kayade Moses, also known as Fields, hosts friends and fans to an exclusive private listening of his latest project titled Feels Good Tribe Take E. Man, it's global. Everybody knows about it. Like, it's global. It's the biggest thing right now since, like, Bad Bunny and J Balvin. Afrobeat is everything right now. So, yes, yeah, so many genres are going to come up. The Altair, Afro Fusion, Afro. I even heard one today. Afro Adura. That's what the gospel. So, it's so amazing. This eight track project features collaborations with Afrobeat superstar David O in track four and Benson, aka Buju, at track number five, which are the biggest hits on the EP. I've listened to the tracks and I can say that Fuse is extremely creative. He gives a lot of room for new ideas, makes your mind travel far. In as much as he tries to be serious with his lyrics, there's a lot of vibe, there's a lot of room. You just have to enjoy it. Like, you can actually chill, get the message, and still party. It's just phenomenal. While delivering a mesmerizing performance at White Lagos, the crowd had an absolute blast listening to these unforgettable tunes. Okay guys, thanks for watching. We hope you enjoyed it. For more news, kindly visit www.southcity.tv.